And this plane went over, yellow. I ran over the house and started to circle around. And all of a sudden, my wife said, you know, there's something going on with that plane. A man describes his shocking sight from his own backyard. Welcome to the Saturday News at 10. I'm Alex Livingston. And I'm Brian Holmes. Tonight, the Payette County Sheriff's Office and the Federal Aviation Administration is continuing an investigation into a deadly plane crash. The plane went down about a mile north of the Payette Airport just before noon today. KTVB's Natalie Shaver went to Payette and spoke with the man who saw the whole thing happen. I did. The man I spoke to lives right by the airport, so he's used to planes flying over his home. So when this plane went over, he knew something was wrong. There were two pieces falling out of the sky, and the plane sputtered a little bit and didn't make another sound, just disappeared. Kenneth Lisby and his wife were doing yard work when they noticed something wasn't right. And this plane went over, yellow, I ran over the house and started to circle around. And all of a sudden, my wife said, you know, there's something going on with that plane. He says not long after, fire engines raced down his street in the direction he saw the plane disappear. So he and his wife headed to the airport for some answers. I was just hoping that he was all right, but he wasn't. Kenneth doesn't know the victim, but says seeing that plane go down is something that will stick with him. I've been thinking about it ever since. It just can't, just can't shake it. Life is awfully, awfully frail. The sheriff's office has identified the victim and has notified the family. Still no word on what caused the crash. Back to you. Thanks so much, Natalie. We'll continue to gather those details and bring them to you as they become available.